seem to be declining in our ability on episode nine. <laughs> it's uh, it's because you had me start pre-gaming. I didn't. I didn't. Make I was. You I do, was more aware of what I'm doing, but I was uh, <laughs> less entertaining in the content. Well, you can go first with your beer because I'm at like eighty percent head right now. It's kind of letting it do its thing. I have. What do I have? Beer. What kind of fucking beer is this? Yeah, it's a beer. I think it's. Hold on, let's try this again. I don't know what kind of fucking beer this is. It's a Florida Citrus Ale. We'll go with by UFO Beer Company, brewed with real. Florida oranges, and it's a little disappointing as far as the amount of information on it compared to UFO fucking... Florida Citrus uh, beer. Yeah, huh. it's a little underwhelming compared to that one that had seventeen fucking words I can yeah. pronounce. We'll give her a taster, but the beer is not disappointing. Beer is not disappointing. That's good. Yeah. It's uh good. We're gonna need a one out of ten. Yeah, I'm gonna need another sip. Uh huh. We're gonna give it an eight. Okay. So you enjoy it. It's good. You'll get it again. Yeah, it's just, yeah. it's nothing special. Maybe I shouldn't have deviated from the sours. <laughs> well, I did not. Um, what you got? I'm sticking with, which might become my new favorite brewing company, uh, Hidden Springs Ale Works. Once again, I think this is the last hour I searched high and low today. Um, the Enchanted Tiki Room, which is a pineapple soft serve inspired sour ale. There you go. Enchanted Tiki Room. The name of it to... reminds me of that little motherfucker from Crash Bandicoot. What was, what was his name? name? I don't know. Probably Enchanted what did... Tiki. What did he do? What was the noise he scene? He was. Oh, blah, blah, blah. I'll add this shit in. What have I got? Wow, pretty good. Well, yeah. All right. Um, like a creamy pineapple sour. Okay. But definitely, when it said like like soft serve inspired, I can taste the where they're coming it from. It's good. Thick. Uh, or yeah. Does it I mean, just have that like. It's been sitting here for a couple minutes, and it still hasn't got all that head down yet. But it's not like those. You ever seen those, like... Oh, no. It's not like... Them. Those, like, the milkshake vis- Viscosity kind of, yeah, is not... Yeah. yeah. No, okay. no, no, not at all. Um, I would say out of 10, I'd probably give it a give it an 8.5. Pretty enjoyable. It's light. It's refreshing. But it's also smooth and creamy. Well, thanks, Hidden Spring Ale Works Beer Brewing Company. Yeah, next time you uh come over here, we're going to have to go there. Mm-hmm. Yes, please. Take down, take it down yonder. I would love again. That. Little do they know, they inspired the name of this uh, podcast. So, yeah, I might never leave. Honestly, if this is, uh, you know, Tampa fourth, or the the brewery, the brewery. This is my fourth beer by them, and each one's been a banger. So, 